best cream ever. Like I still get a few like spots, but I genuinely like have one there, one disappearing there, and like this one's on its way out too. But I don't think my skin has like been so clear since I first had puberty. <laughs> it's been I don't even like my skin's never been like overly bad, but it has never like obviously you can see like the like scarring because I pick my spots a lot, but um that's, that's apparently a family habit. Everyone does it in my family. And I'm like, I literally grew up telling my mommy, it's like, stop picking your, your spots. Or, or my mommy. <laughs> I told my mommy, um, you'd always like give off about it. And now here I am, I have scarred my face because I also do it. But yeah. This is the clearest it's ever been. And obviously because I wear tan all the time, it doesn't be very clear very often. But I still have like tan on. And like look, I got like one annoying spot, which like is in a place that you can't really notice it because it's just where my lip curls. So you can't even really see it. When I make on tonight, like you really won't see it. That's good. <sighs> so that's an update on my new skincare routine. Never had one before. They're called magic because they literally are. <laughs> Let's go get some ice cream. Evening. I'm a little more put together now because we're going out for drinks. I'll show you my outfit in a second. I'm just putting my shoes on. I did my head sticking up there. I did my makeup with like all my drawers and all my the usual. I've started using, I'll show you in a second. Um, it's the pink honey like eyebrow stuff and I like spike my eyebrows up and I do them first and then I like carve them out. I'm really loving it. I haven't carved my eyebrows out in years to be fair. Um, but I'm enjoying it. I think it looks good. I didn't bring any eyeshadow with me so <laughs> I can't tie my nails. It's my dyspraxia is really coming out right now. I can't tie my nails. It's this. I got it for my birthday off my friend Nicole. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go put my shoe on. Back in a minute. This is the outfit. I'm just wearing this little dance top. I'm a new pull and bear. Cargo's trainers. Hello. So. Today was our last like full day, but I was trying a very slow and painful death today, so I didn't feel much at all. But we do have a little bit of time tomorrow, so vlog that and then I'll get this edit. This is this is gonna work for like two weeks because I'm gonna go up to edit. Um but I'm literally still hungover. It's like 12 o'clock at night and I'm still hungover. I put like makeup on and everything to like make me feel a bit better. But it's like, it's just like the skin tint so it doesn't look like there's a lot. But yeah, that's the story. Talk to you tomorrow. Good morning. So it's home day. So I'm packing up my stuff. I'm getting ready. Um, it's a long five hour drive home, so that'll be really good fun. Um, I'm wearing leggings today because I'm not driving home in my like, jeans because that's just not comfortable. Um, I just moisturize around it, struggling to get this jewelry. There we go. 
necklace. And this one's hard to get off. And I'm so proud of this. And he has a five hour drive home. I think we're gonna stop our friend's house in Drogheda. And then I need to stop at my house, like my home house, my mom's house, and get her to sign a form. And then we're going back to Belfast because I have a job interview in the morning for placement. So that is fun. It's at half ten. So that'll be a really good crack. Um, I need to get up the road like early enough so that I can actually look over stuff because I haven't really looked over anything since being down here. But it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Finally. Um, and yeah, I'm going to get some breakfast. I can't vlog a bit more today. Don't want to vlog this one on like the road. Um, I need to pack all my stuff because I'm an overbacker. Like majorly. It's actually a bit ridiculous. But yeah, I will talk to you later. Okay, I'm packing my bag now. I brought so much stuff. It's just so unnecessary. Shorts. Oh, there are those. We have stopped in Kells. Got a wrap. And some cheesy chips. We made it home. I'm gonna eat my McDonald's. Talk to you tomorrow. Hello. Okay, so this is going to be the end of the vlog, but I thought I would just do a little mini haul of some stuff I got while I was down in Claire. I had makeup on earlier. I don't even know if I took it off right, but I've just like literally cleaned this entire house. Minus the kitchen. Okay, right, I haven't cleaned the entire house. I hoovered like the stairs right the way up to my room and the this room. And then I clean, like we spent all day cleaning like this room. And uh, I just need to like sort my room out with like crap that I don't want to move over to the new house. Um, but yeah, so that's what I've been doing all day. The makeup was running off my face. I did have an interview this morning, so that's why I had makeup on in the first place. But we went to this little shop in Ennis and it was called, um, I went to Willow. Uh, I just, I literally just got a t-shirt. I've needed a little white t-shirt for a while. Um, so I got this little... It says Astro Vibe and it's got this nice pattern on the back. And the brand is Vero Moda. Do you know where you go to like those nice shops in like, like not cities, but in like little towns, you know, like in Arma or... Um, in the likes of like Ennis or anything they have like the smaller like almost like boutiques they do like nice stuff that like not everybody else is wearing so I got that and I really liked it and then I got some snacks so I got this bag of Nutella biscuits that are I kid you not the best things I've ever had in my life I'm absolutely starving after all my cleaning today so I'm going to snack on these and then I got the southern tato because it just has to be done because it's so good and we can't get it up here and it's so annoying but that is the end of the vlog i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>